Large manufacturers vying for shelf space use retail simulation to justify product facings and assortment of products on a shelf level, allowing a non-linear storytelling opportunity that engages the viewer and creates an atmosphere of collaboration and understanding of the total space. But when we started to leverage gaming technology for the visualization of higher resolution imagery, larger models, it allowed us to become fully immersed in the environment. The consumer-based design principles that are pulled out of research in a retail simulation environment drive store design in the future. I would say the key benefits to virtual experience include rapid prototyping and fast concept to delivery. The contrast between real-time 3D experiences and 2D planograms is mainly the ability to plan versus present. Uh, 2D planograms are very good for planning the layout of a store shelf, but when it comes time to present to a client, you will want to present them in such a way that it can look as if you're standing in front of a real physical shelf. The biggest emerging technologies I see affecting retail simulation are definitely the head-mounted displays that are coming out from Oculus, from Valve, from Samsung, from HTC. My holy grail is an online shopping experience that allows a shopper to easily move between departments and recognize their brand, size on shelf, and allows them to shop online just as though they would in their local store that they're so comfortable in. It's a huge model. But technology grows in leaps and bounds. Database-driven deliveries are becoming the norm.